Hi everyone, Petal is blessed here. I'm coming on today to do a candle holder DIY with you guys. So we need two jars. We need the candle holders. I have three of them. Um, we need the bling out gems. <laughs> Um, we will be using this glue from the Dollar Tree and we also need our glue gun so let's get started on this DIY So as you can see, I'm placing the gems all around and I'm doing one row large, one row small, one row large. Okay, let's continue. And I'm all done the first one. All the gems all the way around. Looks very nice. <laughs> now we're going to start on the second one. Then I will come back to you guys after I've done that one. Alright everyone. I'm finished. The two of them. Which they look very nice. And now we're going to um, glue them together with the glue from the dollar store. I already glued these two together so they're um, drying. And they're going to have to set overnight. So I'm going to glue the small one on. And this glue is very liquidy. It's not like the glue gun that um, dries very fast. This one takes a longer time to dry. But the hold is very good. Just like the E6000. So I'm just going to apply some weight to that so it doesn't shift. Okay, now it's the next morning and they're all set. And I'm just going to add some little gems just to touch it up a bit and hide the spot where I did the glue in the center. Just add some little gems and make it look nice. Why isn't he here? And here is the finished look everyone. I think they look very nice. Very nice blinked out candle holders. Nice and elegant. All right, everyone, I'm just showing you the flower arrangements that I made to go with these two candle holders. I put them together, I made them as a three piece set, and I think they look so lovely together. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, everyone, thank you so much for coming on today and seeing my DIYs that I did for today. And remember, as always, stay blessed from Petal is Blessed. <laughs> bye bye, everyone. Yeah, yeah,